Buenas and half a day. I am Congresswoman Madeline Berdalio, representing the U.S. Territory of Guam. And I want to wish everyone a happy Whistleblower Day as we celebrate the 240th anniversary of our nation's first law to protect whistleblowers. Unfortunately, I am heading back to Guam and unable to attend this year's event in person. But I do want to thank the National Whistleblower Center as we recognize the contributions of whistleblowers to good governance, the rule of law, and for their commitment to the truth. There is bipartisan support in Congress for empowering whistleblowers to help us tackle the global wildlife trafficking and poaching crisis. Wildlife trafficking and illegal, unreported, and unregulated fishing rank among the top global crimes. And these criminal activities generate billions in illicit profits each year for transnational criminal organizations and extremist groups. These same groups are responsible for human right violations and narcotics, weapons, and human trafficking. In tackling the global wildlife trafficking trade, Congress can help to conserve iconic wildlife and cut off illicit financing for groups responsible for these human right abuses, global political corruption, and even terrorism. Whistleblowers are a proven resource for law enforcement, and we should engage them in the fight to prosecute wildlife poachers and take down trafficking rings. By encouraging whistleblowers on wildlife trafficking and related crimes to come forward, Congress can increase enforcement and leverage existing federal resources. Marine wildlife species often go overlooked, but are increasingly targeted by poachers, traffickers, and illegal fishing. Across the Pacific, we are increasingly seeing foreign fishing fleets forcing vulnerable people smuggled out of their home countries and taking illegal narcotics as stimulants to fish around the clock without rest out of fear for their very lives. These seafood products are largely untraceable and without help from whistleblowers could end up in your grocery store aisle, on the menu at your favorite restaurant, or on your dinner table. Whistleblowers can provide the actionable intelligence needed to prosecute these crimes and advance American leadership in eliminating the global trade in trafficking wildlife and illegal seafood products harvested with slave labor. And we can do all of this with existing federal resources at no cost to taxpayers. So again, I want to thank the National Whistleblower Center for highlighting these critical issues. These are concrete steps that we can take right now to tackle these global problems. All it takes is the will to act. Thank you.